Hi, welcome to This Week in Ames. I'm Susan Guiazda. Today we check in at Homewood Golf Course. My guest today is Chris Barkema, Recreation Coordinator with the City of Ames. Chris, welcome to the show. Thank you. Well, it's great to be out here at beautiful Homewood Golf Course, and we understand you're opening very soon. Yep, we'll be open on April 5th as our first day, hopefully barring any unforeseen weather incidents coming up. Um, and we'll be ready to sell passes and, and get ready for leagues and things like that. Well, it's really been a long winter, and I know people are looking forward to getting outside again. Anything that they should look for in particular here at Homewood this year? Um, a lot of the stuff that we have as... as been in the past we've had the same things um, we have a putting green that's relatively new a couple years old um, we've added some cart paths um, all of the carts this year will be electric no gas carts um, which is which is nice i know the customers really like those um, but aside from that everything else is, is pretty much the same as it's been so if you liked golfing here last season you will be set for this season yes you'll love it it'll be fantastic so tell me a little bit about Homewood Golf Course. For somebody who hasn't been here before, how would you describe it? Um, we are a, a shorter course, uh, nine holes is all we have, not an 18-hole course or anything like that. Um, definitely walking friendly. Um, it's, it's just a little bit over a total mile walk, um, barring any balls that might go to and fro that you have to chase after. Um, it's tons of mature trees. It's almost like walking through um, a little bit of a, kind of like a forest area. Um, very nice out there. Um, the greens and, and the tee boxes, fairways are in great condition. Well, located at 20th and Duff, we are right in the middle of a residential neighborhood. You bet. You have houses so, on just about every side. Easy to drive past and maybe not even realize it's a golf course. It is so beautiful and, and soon to be green out here. Yeah, I hope so. <laughs> so um, what kind of customer do you see here at Homewood? Um, a lot of times we'll get just beginning golfers. So it's great for families with young kids to come out and, and learn to golf out here. Um, also, um, it seems like we get a lot of the older retired folks that come out as well and they play cribbage here for hours and hours and they go out and golf and um, so we get the, a wide range from the beginning golfer to the people that have golfed for 30, 40, 50 years. We also host leagues out here. Yes, yep, we have leagues. Uh, Monday nights we have our ladies after work league. Um, Tuesday nights we have couples league, um, so you and your husband can come out and golf. Absolutely. Uh, Wednesday nights we have a city employees league. Thursday mornings we have a retired women's golf league. And then Friday mornings are our junior league for the kids in junior high, some high school kids as well. So I know in the past you've run specials, golfing specials, after certain hours, mm -hmm. if it reaches a certain temperature, or should we look for those kinds of um, fun things this summer as well? Yep, we'll be doing the same same type of things. Um, if you come out before three o'clock uh, during the week, it's $9 for a round of golf, um, so a dollar a hole. If it's afterwards, after three o'clock, it's twelve seventy-five. dollars um, Other specials that we have are on the weekends, um, you're able to come out after 6 o'clock, and it's $9 for, for nine holes then. Um, and then we do have like parent-child or grandparent and child times on Tuesdays from noon to 3, and it's only $6 for each person on those days, and then Sundays after 3 o'clock. So if you're not um, familiar with golfing, do you have clubs here for rent? We do, absolutely. We have clubs that you can, you can rent as well as we do have some... Um, golf carts that you can use and pull carts as well so not just the driving golf carts but pull carts you can use so really again if you're if you're a familiar golfer with a veteran golfer you're out here but also if you don't know the sport very well you could come out here and, and uh, it would be a nice course to learn on yes yes this is probably the best course in town to if you're just beginning and you can be 45 year old just beginning or you can be a nine year old just beginning and it's a great place to learn out here so are you a good golfer, Chris? I am a terrible golfer. I love it, but I am not very good. <laughs> but we do have a lot of good golfers out here. One of the things that we talked about, I think, in the past has been um, the, the people who have been lifelong golfers. And what's your special for those, those very, very senior golfers? If you, if you are 90 years old, you can golf all you want for free. Um, once you get to 90, it's free golf from then on. And you have 90-year-old golfers. We have, I think this year we should have four, four 90-year-old golfers. And of those four, all of them are out here at least five times a week. 
That is an amazing story. What, yes. a, what a great story. And what a great skill to have to keep you active all year. Golf is, is I think, um, probably undervalued in its, its physical fitness requirements. Yes, and, and that's probably one of the best things out here. Since we are a little bit shorter, um, just about everybody can walk. And you're able to walk. It gets you about a mile's worth of, of walking. And it's enjoyable. It's fun to do. It's not something that you feel like you have to do. It's something you want to do. And after a round of golf, can you come back here and get a beverage? Yep, absolutely. You come, come on in and you can get a soda or, or water or anything else you want. Well, obviously this is going to be the place to be fr uh, Friday, April 5th, the opening day. And yep. then how late in the season do you stay open? We try to stay open until around Halloween. Um, and then depending on weather, it'd be a few days either before or after is our closing date. So a lot of good golfing ahead of us. Absolutely. Hope so. Well, it's always fun to be out here. Thanks for inviting us, and we look forward to a great golf season. You bet. Thank you. So if you're interested in golfing this summer, you might want to get one of those season passes. You can come out to Homewood Golf Course and pick up a season pass at 20th and Duff, or you can always buy one at the Community Center Gymnasium at 515 Clark Avenue. Also, thinking about summer activities, you might want to pick up those Furman Aquatic Center passes. Those are on sale till May 15th for a 10% discount. If you were a season pass holder last summer and purchase again, you'll get a 20% discount. Well, that's our show for today. Thanks for watching, and tune in next week for This Week in Ames.